Says his greetings, welcome back to Slosh's Bar and Grill for day 16 of our hot sauce advent calendar for 2014. 25 sauces, 25 days. Here we are at sunny Cottesloe Beach. No, we're not. It was a beautiful day at the beach today, but uh, as you can see, various family stuff came up again and we didn't get on location. I'm really, really hoping to tomorrow, but I've realised that I'm not going to... I'm not going to promise something that I can't actually deliver. Really hoping we actually get out of the house tomorrow. So what we are going to do for today, sauce, um, I just had to get that out of the way. I mean, I can't, I was considering putting up like a green screen and seeing if I could do that. Then I realized it was already 9.30 at night and I have to get up early for the kids in the morning. So that would have taken far too long to learn how to use a green screen, um, find a green screen and set up a green screen. So we have from Fire Dragon Chilies in New Zealand, we have gourmet chili sauce, which sounds really interesting. Uh, it says gourmet chili sauce. This Central American style sauce is a mixture of chilies from around the globe. It's all natural and full of goodness. It goes great with anything that needs a bit of heat. Um, it says shake well before use and refrigerate when it's opened. Ingredients in this order. Carrot, which is weird. Carrot is the main ingredient in a hot sauce. Uh, carrot, chili, organic cider vinegar, spring water, onion, garlic, lemon, lime olive oil, organic sea salt. Sounds really interesting. They've given it a heat rating 5 out of 10, so... But um, this did sound really interesting, so. Oh, wow. That does smell interesting. Hmm. I really miss having a table in front of me, you know, to, to pour this stuff on. I always feel like we're going to make a hell of a mess of my bedroom floor. You can't have the dogs clean this stuff up, can you? Apparently it would be bad for them. So we have a nice tablespoon of that. It looks like it's got a really nice consistency to it. This bit's trying to get away. That smells really interesting. So without further ado, on the 16th day of Christmas, slosh eight. Gourmet chili sauce from Fire Dragon Chilies. Mmm. Definitely taste the carrot. That's really interesting. Tastes like roast carrot or mashed carrot. We we uh, mash carrot for the uh, for the baby, but uh, has that consistency. But it tastes really really good. It's kind of it's a very subtle flavour. It's not a strong flavour. A little bit of hint of the garlic in there. Not oh, uh, too heat. I will give it. Six flavour because I haven't tried it with anything. I think that'll be great on hamburgers. I think that'll be great on. I have to say pork because I always say pork. I think that'll be really good on lamb for some reason. Like roast lamb. Um, we have a couple of lamb chops that we had for dinner. I might go out and try that actually. Um, interesting flavour. Not a very, very strong flavour. And after all the ones I've had in the last, what, 15 days. Um, it feels like it's missing something, but but I really like it, and I think it's going to really complement food really well. Um, I really can imagine it in like a hamburger with lots of salad and, and burger and cheese and stuff. Like I reckon that would be really good. I don't think this is too hot for Mama Cassie that I might get get her to go give it a go. So yeah, I'm going to go I'm going to go six on flavour for this one, but I have a feeling that's because I've had so many so many really really strong flavoured sauces in the past. Um, what, 15 days in a row. I'm going to give it two heat. Absolutely nothing wrong with this. I really like it. But, yeah, it just, it just feels like it's missing something. Hmm. Well, hopefully we'll be out on location tomorrow. I do apologise. All you guys get to see is these books and this face. So, I'm going to try and get into Fremantle tomorrow. I don't know if it's going to happen, though. So, as always, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for putting up with me every single day. And I will see you tomorrow. Merry Christmas.